yeah, when we first moved here, obviously landing in um uh, landing in Chicago, <laughs> coming out, being in being in, you know, like a maybe like a thin hoodie. And then we see we see Giannis that we haven't seen in months. He looks looks about two inches taller. I haven't I, I hadn't seen Giannis in about maybe ten months. So uh, he looks like two inches taller. Yeah, he grew about 10, 50, 15 pounds bigger. So I'm looking at him. I'm, he's, he has his coat. You know what I'm saying? He has like two, three layers on. He got his, and he's like, hey, man, it's cold. And we walk out in the snow. We're like, oh, man, it's, what's going on? And he, uh, he picks us up and uh, he picks us up in the limousine and just like going, having that cultural shock and taking the taxi, taking the taxi to the airport in, in Greece, waiting there and then going. Yeah. To that, to land in America, I, getting picked up in a limousine. I, I I can only imagine, man. I can only imagine. And and the other thing is like, we're talking about Greece, right? Greece is like six months summer, to say. Yeah. Please. So you, you, I kind of understand what you mean exactly. Yeah, and and just. But uh, you, so you're 12 years old, and you get picked up in a limousine, with uh, Giannis, that 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 damn, mom, everybody, right? Closest. That's why you guys are acting like this, man. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Had the life, man. Yeah, we we had to go through the. And I'm, <laughs> I remember just thinking, I, we went to, um, uh, I believe we went to like a clothing store, okay, local, lo- local clothing store. We went stopped, and I remember like people trying to talk to us. We were just looking at them like, we don't understand you, but yeah, I want that. I want that, man. I need something to keep me warm. Okay. And I'm just thinking in my head, I'm talking to closest, I'm tapping, I'm like, we looking outside. Mind you, we're we're shocked. And this is this is Milwaukee and we're shocked. So I'm just like, man, this is America. And, and I, I, I just yeah, I felt that that's the moment I fell in love with America for Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I, I think people don't understand for people who are not from here, like the opportunity to come into another country, do something great for your family. It's it goes a long way, long ways. And but it's not just that. I remember people used to tell me like Milwaukee, what? Milwaukee, why? And this and that. I'm like, I, and I used to tell people, I love Milwaukee. <laughs> I know. And people was, would be like, what? Why? I said, doesn't make any difference to me, guys. I'm not from here. I love Milwaukee. I yeah. love like, obviously it's cold. Yeah, <laughs> it's cold. There's no denying that. But there's not denying that. But it's it's grown so much, bro. It's grown so much. And even every, and ever since we won the championship, I had a. I think it was a similar story. I was talking. I don't know if I told you this, but I was talking with uh, Bobby. And he was saying like after the championship that. He didn't pay anyway, bro. After the championship, for a year or more, probably even more, I never played anywhere. I ne- I went to to eat, I went to anything I went to. People was like, "Hey man, we love you, we love your family," and like, "Nah, now nah, you you're not gonna pay and everything." And and the reason is not because I, I don't. The reason I feel grateful is not because you know oh, I didn't pay or, or stuff like that. It's not because of that. It's because they really acknowledge the hard work you put in. They, they, this is not easy to do, you know. And people like support you every day. And I see your like your comments and people really always uh, and t- like texting you and everything, and you know, you know, on social media and everything, saying like, "Man, Alex, keep going, man. You're gonna do this and that, and don't listen to nobody." Like that's that's inspiring. That's motivating. You know, it's, it's unbelievable what what obviously you guys' championship did to to the city. You know, to the city. Obviously, I moved here when I was twelve. So, and in in a way, I kind of feel like I'm from here. So, yes, yes. So I was I was not only proud because you know because of you guys and you were able to get a championship. I was proud because the city the city got one. You know, it feel you as know. if it was the one day you could walk, you could go anywhere. You could go to you could go to the store, you could go to the mall, you could go anywhere, and everybody was happy, man. Everybody, everybody. it's just like the energy about the city just man. just shifted. They did. They, 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 they de- definitely needed this.